Hey guys, this is uh, Shane Russell with Suited Marketing and I'm going to walk you through uh, the donation instruction and form for an individual who has donated to the Shanghai Healing Home uh, project and for the Shakes Overseas initiative. Uh, they'll be able to fill out this form under the Ship a Shake which has all the information that they need. Uh, I'm going to walk you through that real quick and I'm, as well as the process and the back end to show you how to be able to update this information. So what they'll do is they'll come to this page. Uh, a lot of this information is pre-populated already uh, I, even though I've already filled out this form I'll kind of tell you real quick. So the date will be pre-populated as well as a sign up for our newsletter. So the individual what they'll do is they'll fill out uh, the name, company, phone number, email address, their order number from the invoice, quantity, uh, how much they donated, and as well as the cost for the donation. Uh, the sign up for the newsletter will be for constant contact. So once they have signed up uh, or not, obviously it'll send them an email if they have signed up for confirmation. And so after they've filled out everything, they'll click submit, which will take them to uh, automatically to this PDF form, which automatically populates all the information. It's official receipt. It has uh, everything for the donation that is for tax purposes. And the nice thing about this is you don't have to do anything. It allows them to download it right here. They can either save it or print it out from their computer. And now what they'll receive as far as an email is thank you Shanghai Healing Home has all of the information as well as a link to the website and if they want to do more contribution on a monthly basis they can they would just reply to this email and fill out that also has their donation information that they filled out on the website uh, in case they want to save it for their future use whether they signed up for the newsletter and it also has another downloadable receipt which is the same thing for them to uh, save for later if they lose it or can't find it or what have you. Now as far as the ad actually I apologize there's one more element which is the signing up for the newsletter so thank you for joining our mailing list they'll get an email shakes overseas this is directly from constant contact and it's set up currently for the general interest um, list and then what I'll do is uh, walk you through now from the admin side how it, I'll just kind of go through the reverse steps here so now the first thing you, you as an admin will see is new submission from ship a shake receipt that's the name of that has all of their information uh, just like that they received and everything that they filled out from the website as well as another uh, receipt for your records that way you can save or print it and do with it what you like so you both have a copy of that and then from a admin side of it uh, in order to update the form or notifications or anything else like that you would go to shakes overseas slash WP login PHP fill out your information once you're logged into your dashboard you will go to the forms section uh, if you wanted to make any changes the only thing is with if you want to make any changes to these forms it may not be compatible with a PDF so I want to make sure to explain that to you that you have to be really careful on what you change otherwise it may screw up the receipt um, because of the code that I had to do on my back end for that so as far as uh, notifications uh, you can update this information it's not going to change anything uh, there's an admin notification and a user notification so if you need to uh, change and add maybe an email address for the admin notification this is where you would do it under edit and uh, let's see let's click on that real quick while that's doing that I'll talk about the entries tab here which is under the form still this is uh, the area that shows you all of the people who have submitted um, the form and I think you might be able to let's see view PDF yeah it looks like this will be the receipt also 
give that a second. Uh, mark is red, spam trash, so you can delete all of that. But this is a centralized location that has all of the uh, submissions, all the contact information that they filled out. And there you go. There's the uh, PDF that from clicking view PDF. So it's all right there on the dashboard, which is great, obviously. Um, as far as the notifications, if you want to... Uh, change or add to the send to email you probably I haven't tried this yet but you can just hit comma and then add a new email address here and then it should send it to both actually what I would recommend uh, might work for sure or I know it will work for sure is leave the admin email as the send to email and then blind copy carbon copy to somebody else um, that way two people can get it and you don't have to worry about messing that up and see as far as constant contact if you want to change the list that it is being sent to uh, be within your constant contact account you would go on the left hand side under forms click on constant contact and then uh, you can just click on edit and choose a different list from there so I hope that helps I hope I've covered everything and um, this is a great tool for those of you who want to be able to do this and uh, I can help you with it anytime so look forward to talking to you some more in the future alright thank you bye